All right, guys, it's Christian Guzman, and I just got back from the grocery store. So this is a new episode of Grocery Shopping with Christian. Now, um, I spent about $70 today, guys. We only went to one store. Now, keep in mind, I already have chicken, and I have a lot of protein sources and everything. So this is just some stuff, um, you know, to kind of last me throughout the week. So I'm going to take you through uh, everything one by one, give you some ideas, maybe incorporate it into your diet. Uh, be sure to hit your macros, you know, at the end of the day. Get your one fruit, um, at least one fruit, one veggie. Hit your fiber intake. Get your macros in, hit your calories. So, um, first things first, we're gonna go ahead and start with our carb sources. That's pretty much the main bulk of what we got today. Uh, first thing, I always, always show you guys this. This is Sarah Lee 45 calorie bread. Awesome bread for making sandwiches, um, very low carb, so awesome for dieting. Now, for that bread, we got some uh, Kraft Singles Skim Milk American Cheese. Um, these are awesome just to put on there. The macro switch, guys, 25 calories for one slice, 4 grams of protein, and 2 grams of carbs. So you really can't beat that calories. Um, you know, combined, if you make a sandwich, a slice of cheese, you're looking at 115 calories plus some deli meat. So that's really not much um, compared to other options. So we have that. For the deli meat, we got some uh, honey smoked turkey and some rotisserie seasoned chicken. Um, just a good little source of protein, you know, to change it up. You know, you don't have to eat chicken and rice every single meal. You know, throw turkey in there, throw some uh, rotisserie chicken, throw some, you know, beef, whatever you guys want. So uh, that's for our sandwiches over here. Next thing, guys, we have some fruit. Strawberries are by far my favorite fruit. I definitely recommend strawberries because they're high volume. Um, meaning, if you were to go look at a fruit kind of like pineapple or uh, something a lot more dense um, and less, like, I guess, holds less water. Uh, it's going to be a lot less food for the same calories as something like strawberries where you get more food. Uh, so calories are great, low calorie fruit. Um, strawberries are great, low calorie fruit, I'm sorry. And as far as vegetables guys, I'm planning on making some stir fries this week so maybe I'll show you guys some cool recipes. But um, I bought these vegetables where it's just like an Asian stir fry kind of mix. You know, put this in the pan, uh, throw some rice in there, throw a couple, like an egg or two, and uh, some soy sauce, make it taste great, guys. So, um, we got some Asian medley vegetables. All right, guys, next, these are a new thing um, that I just discovered, and I couldn't be happier, let me tell you guys. These right here are fat-free Pringles, all right? Let me read the macros for these. In one entire container, so the whole entire thing, we're looking at 350 carbs. We're looking at exactly, let's see, 60, hold on for my math, 75 grams of carbs for this whole entire thing, um, zero grams of fat, and five grams of protein, five grams of fiber. So awesome, awesome alternative, guys. Um, if you ever need some extra carbs at night, this is a great way to not add any fat and increase your carbs. So you got the fat-free original and the fat-free sour cream and onion. Definitely try these out, guys. I've already tried them. They taste almost just like the sale, like the real ones. Um, next is a nice little alternative alternative protein source. We have Danon Light and Fit Greek Yogurt. These are about 12 or 13 uh, grams of protein per container, um, only 80 calories per container, and just a really great option. You know, nice and cool, kind of tastes like a dessert. Now, um, a cool thing you guys should try is if you want these guys, refrigerate them and throw in some rice cakes. So dip your rice cakes in these and it'll taste like heaven. Um, we got caramel corn. Uh, I think these are 50 calories each. Yeah, 50 calories. And we got chocolate. These are 60 calories each. So beware, they're all not the same calories, but um, you know, you'll only be off by 10, maybe 15 calories at the most. So um, chocolate, caramel, dip them in the strawberry, and you got an awesome tasting dessert, guys. Other than that, we just got some cups. Um, you know, no point in washing all the dishes, guys. You can just throw it away, disposable. But um, here, these are my favorite, I guess, kind of flexible dieting food. Um, skinny Cow ice cream sandwiches, vanilla flavor, 150 calories. Uh, very easy to fit in one of these a day, maybe even two if you have higher carbs. Um, but very easy to fit those in. I'm actually going to put these in the freezer right now so they don't melt. And a couple more things, guys. Sorry. We got some salsa. I make a lot of egg beaters, which I forgot to buy. But um, anyway, I make a lot of egg beaters and eggs and stuff, so salsa tastes awesome on them. Um, I love adding salsa. We got some fiber one cereal. So if you ever have trouble getting your fiber intake, now how much fiber do you need per day? Uh, good rule of thumb, for every 1,000 calories you take in, 
So let's say you take in 3,000 calories, right? You want to get between 10 and 15 grams of fiber per 1,000 calories. So you know, take 12 for an estimate, or 12 for like a, an average, I guess. If you're uh, taking in 3,000 calories, aim for 36 grams of fiber per day. Anywhere between t uh, 10 and 15. So that's all I got, guys. Um, a lot of carbs, good source of carbs, some fruits, some veggies, some eggs. We got just some normal whole eggs right here, guys. Go through these. These help me finish off my fat intake for the day. Um, oh, and last but not least, we have our Sprite Zero. Zero calories. Um, I try to throw in one of these a day. But fine, guys, just be sure to drink enough water. Um, don't get dehydrated and then have a soda, you know. Be sure you're getting at least a gallon a day of straight water. Then add in whatever else you want. So, um, yeah, guys, throw these into your diet. It'll make dieting a lot easier. I can't stress enough how much easier and simpler and how much more sane you're going to be if you throw in some nice foods like this. Um, again, don't forget your fruit, your vegetables, your fiber, and then you can start adding in, you know, some like some ice cream sandwiches or um, some Pringles and stuff like that. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't. Uh, check out my Instagram at Christian Usman Fitness. That's just the name, you know, no underscores or anything. Uh, my Facebook fan page and my Facebook personal page are in the description box. And uh, stay tuned for the next episode, guys. So be sure to subscribe. Thank you.